Okay, so now that we have the pink key, we can open up this door right here. And have access to the first floor. Now, we have been to the second floor for a large percent of this playthrough so far. But uh, we can't access the rest of the second floor from here. We actually got to go through the first floor and do some things there first. So let's uh, make our way back down. I don't think any of the gold uh, respawns. I think if you already get the... Uh, yeah, if you already grab the gold, it won't appear anymore, unfortunately. I could have really used that to my advantage. So while we're in here, let's go ahead and take a look at this. Uh, there are a few rooms that are locked. Not all of the rooms are locked, though. As you can see, there's a room kind of in the top portion that's not locked. And there's also a door over here that's unlocked. Oh, God. Ignore those ghosts whenever they appear. They're just annoying. Okay, now we're actually in the basement. And, uh, this room up here is actually, uh, open. And there is our first... Sprinty spirits, or sprint spirit, or whatever they're called. We got some good money out of that. What we collected was a blue sapphire. The blue sapphires are pretty cool. They're uh, diamonds that give you a lot of money at the very end, so I'm glad we collected that. But now let's make our way down here, down this hallway. You'll see a lot of ghosts in these hallways. The, a lot of these ghosts only have zero HP, so they're not really anything to worry yourself about. Let's actually go inside this door right here. That's unlocked. Okay, it looks like we're in a bathroom. Oh god. I hate these ghosts. These ghosts will try to grab you. If they do grab you, spin the control stick and they'll stop grabbing you. Hehehe. <laughs> looks like you ran into a bit of trouble there. Maybe you need more training. There are some ghosts who will try to grab and hold you. When that happens, try moving your control stick back and forth to shake them off. It's the age-old struggle for survival, my boy. Don't lose heart, Luigi. I appreciate the uh, I appreciate the worry, but I think we'll be fine. Let's, uh, okay, I can't get all the way over there, unfortunately. Um, okay, I think we'll just get the key then. This key will open up uh, that door down there, so we're going to go there next. I think that's all I can really uh, explore in here right now, so let's uh, let's make way back to that door. Stop that. Leave me alone. Okay, so now we have uh, Shy Guy Ghosts, and we're in the ballroom. Uh, shy Guy Ghosts are kind of annoying. You have to uh, get rid of their mask before you try to capture them. And whenever you uh, get rid of their dancing partner, they'll start to attack you. Because they group up a lot, you can... Uh, Try to get a bunch of them at once. Oh, 
Come on. The problem I kind of have with this game is I feel like uh, there are some times where whenever I press the R button, it doesn't activate in time. I'm not sure if that's just me being slow, though, or if that's actually a problem. I don't really know. We have a nice little uh, ghostly couple right here. Let's uh, go ahead and take a look at them. So you can see me. Well, that may be, but you will never find my weakness. I don't think this gent can even see us. Here's the secret for these guys. You want to stay on the rotating platform. When you're on that, you can see them. Or you can see their heart anyway. Okay. Oh wow, I got them all in one try too. Awesome. So yeah, since I did that, I'm going to get the gold frame for that ghost. We can also pick up the pearls for a small other reward as well. I'm gonna grab the key. That will open that door right there. Alright. Can I uh, maybe get some... Okay, nope, nothing there. What about here? There's two of these. Nope. You're really not gonna give me anything, are you? Looks that way. Okay, what's in this next room? This room is the... Storage room! And... Ah, dang it! Stupid ghost. Oh wait, I might get him. I might get him anyway! Oh, shoot. I lost some money, but, um... Honestly, I got the gold bars. The gold bars are going to be worth it more than a bunch of coins. So, uh, I'm going to I'm going to consider that a victory. I'm surprised I was actually able to get that. I thought that ghost was going to be long gone. I'm doing pretty good on those. I haven't found any gold mice yet, but the gold mice I think are harder to find. that I'm losing money, but at least they're coins, not gold bars. That's really the only thing I can say. Hey, there's a switch I can see back on this wall. Oh, okay. There's a secret to this room. This secret kind of, kind of worries me a little bit, though. Oh, yeah. Well, let's uh, go over here. What's down here? Can I take a look at it? Nope, not really. Well, I can move this. Maybe. Uh-oh. A big red button. This could be a bad idea, folks. I'm gonna try it anyway. Oh god, booze. Who's there? Who dares disturb our sleep? Oh no, it's Luigi! Look, guys, Luigi's finally here. We're gonna do to you what we did to your brother, only worse. What's on his back? It's the ECAT's Poltergeist 3000. Everybody scram! Uh-oh, well we just released a bunch of booze. Luigi, are you okay? That was them. Those were the ones who released all of the ghosts from the paintings in my gallery. Those fiends. I wondered where King Boo and his gang had gone, so they were hiding in the mansion all along. Thanks for flushing him out, Luigi. I'm tickled you found him, but perhaps it would have been better if you hadn't. Well, let every single one escape. 
Just a thought. Ah oh, well, water under the bridge. Anyway, you should probably come back to the lab for a sec. I've been waiting for you, young Luigi. I'm not that young. Your brother must have been taken by that gang of booze. Poor feller. Oh now, don't talk crazy. They're not gonna eat the man. But what became of him? Hmm? Odd that he hasn't come back. Common theory holds that booze grow in strength when they travel in numbers. They must be somehow... They must somehow combine their powers, too. Their power likely overwhelmed your brother. If your aim is to save Mario, there is but one way to do it. Capture each Boo and slowly weaken the group's power. But Boos, as their name implies, like to hide and then jump out to scare people. You've got your work cut out in finding them. Heh <laughs> heh, don't get all down in the mouth, my boy. That Game Boy Horror I gave you has a secret function. I knew it'd come in handy one day, so I developed it secretly. I call it the Boo Radar. The Boo Radar will flash red when something round, like a Boo, is hidden nearby. Use it to search everywhere, Luigi. All right now, Sonny. Don't go tuckering yourself out. Relax. And just try to get those boos one at a time. The trick is using the control stick and the C stick together. Don't forget now. Okay, so now we're going to capture boos. We have a little uh, meter, I think. Or we will have a little meter. Might have to actually capture one first. I'm also going to stop by Chansey's room first so I can get that big heart. I'm kind of uh, hurting big time right now. So there are 50 boos throughout the mansion, and uh, we are going to try to capture them all. You only need to capture 40 to beat the game, but uh, I feel like capturing them all. That's just me. That's just what I feel like doing. Uh, you have that radar at the very bottom. Whenever the radar flashes red, you are very close to a boo, so look for the boo and try to flush him out and capture him. And that's pretty much all you have to do. And in order to find the boos, you actually have to make sure all the lights are on first. And there's one boo in every every main room of the game so you're essentially gonna have to go through all the rooms of the mansion usually rooms where you have to fight a bunch of boos or rooms where uh, you fight a portress ghost there's some rooms where they may not appear because the room is too small to hold them I think that bathroom we were in a little bit ago I don't think the boos can appear in that room but uh, they will appear everywhere else, I think. And that's, uh, that's pretty much it. That's pretty much all you have to do to capture these guys. They're really not too bad. The further we get into the game, the more HP they're going to have, though. So they only have, like, 30 HP, 50 HP now. Later on in the game, they can have up to, I think, uh, 300. One thing I like is all of their names are actually puns or jokes or references in some way. So, like, right now we had uh, Taboo. And then earlier we had Turbo instead of Turbo. Just cool little, uh, cool little references like that, I guess. So I'm going to go through all these rooms really quickly. I think after we get five of them, we can actually technically move on. You can interact with the object, or you can uh, use your poltergeist on the object. Sometimes they'll throw bombs at you, so be careful. Ah, oh, dang it. No, here. There he is. There we have Bamboo. A 
I'm just waiting now for Huckleberry Finn. That would have been an interesting name. Okay. Nope. Nope. Oh, wait, yep. I was right. Bootha! Hey, Bootha, what's going on, buddy? Uh, they will try to go into other rooms, so if you let one escape, uh, make sure you go into the room based on what wall they entered. So, because that boo went in the south wall, it was logical he was going to go in this room. It can be kind of hard to keep track of, uh... Boos that end up in the hallway, because then they can go into a wall and sometimes you don't know which room they went into. In that case, you just have to pay special attention to uh, the map and uh, what room it looked like they went in. That's pretty much it. It's not too bad. A <laughs> Game Boo Advance. I like that one. I like all the boos that are references to uh, like video games and stuff. So one thing that they actually did, or EGAD did, was he actually told us to pay a visit to the washroom. I think he said that. If not, we're going to be told that here in a little bit, but um, that's essentially how we're going to progress with the game. It's kind of good to go back and capture all of these boos anyway, just because... Uh, that way you won't have to go back through all the rooms again. Oh, yeah. okay, here we have Boo La La. Now we gotta find a boo in here. Okay, nope, it's over here. Oh. And sometimes you can also get a boo ball. Boo balls are just uh, little ball objects that just try to fake you out. All right, I forgot that I don't need my flashlight. Mm -hmm. eh. So because that happened, uh, we're going to have some trouble catching this guy. He's probably going to end up going into a different room, too. Okay, so he's going to go in there. We'll be in that room pretty soon, so we'll be able to get him relatively soon anyway. I, uh, dropped a really important thing into the toilet. I didn't mean to. Don't worry about it, young toad. It happens, I guess. Did you really just try to make some jokes about toilets, toad? I don't even know you anymore. So yeah, rooms like these, uh, there's no booze in these rooms. But we are going to get that key. That key will allow us to go all the way down there. Doing a lot of wandering around here. Not sure how I feel about that. Also, hmm. A floating candlestick, huh? Not sure how I feel about that. 